Okay, what I'm doing here is, is a tabletop and I'm going to cut a chamfer edge along the side and I thought I would use a fun tool, an axe so you could cut it on the bandsaw, which I was going to do and it's too um, heavy to do it on my own and I was over in Norway and they taught me how to work with an axe and so what you can quite easily do if you practice is you can create quite a bit of this just with an axe so as you can see it's really fast and it's much more sa satisfying than having to use a machine and it's really quite fast as well I was using a draw knife, which you can also use, but I found that sliding it around too much. So I found that if you use an axe, it seems to work easier. I find it hard to see with the light, so I don't know if I get a spotlight onto this. Let me tap a bit. Now with this technique you got to watch your leg, so I'm really not using that much force. If you're swinging really hard you could um, slide off and hit your leg. I'm trying to hit it in a way that it would swing behind me. So that's really quite important for safety. If you're feeling very, I think it was ambidextrous. I'm gonna try and do this with my uh, left hand, which is fun. Just like other things like that. So as you can see, using that is quite easy because I've never um, used this tool with my left hand before. It's just the same technique. Uh, I guess I could sit on top of you, but uh, yeah, it's just fun. And the axe is one that I got. Um, uh, Swedish by a company called Wetterlings. Look at that. How cool is that? Oh, what a beast!